morning, Facebook. Good afternoon. It's Labor Day, and I'm putting in my work. This is dedicated to the King family, Val King and the King family, Lake County, Illinois, Southside, OGs, original gangsters. I made a promise to Val that I wouldn't put my guns and I wouldn't put, I wouldn't seek revenge for the death of my son. I was going to be a better person. I wasn't going to be bitter. But that promise took me till today. I kept my word. I'm done with all my promises. I kept my promise to my mother, kept my promise to my family. I kept my promise to Jarrell, and now I kept my promise to Val. I'm ready to give up my citizenship here in America. <laughs> this right here, you feel me? I'm a king. I'm good wherever I go. I was born and raised a free man. Don't nobody own me. I own me. Like I said, I made a promise to Val. I was making this movie, and this documentary was called Letters Design. That's one movie. I had 14 other movies. That's... A lot of movies, and I've been doing it over the last 13 years since 2006. It covers my life since 1972. Y'all talking about George Floyd, Blake, the rioting going on in Kenosha? Man, I'm a 50s baby. We've been doing this since 1959. 1957, y'all killed Emmett Till. You killed Martin. You killed Malcolm. You killed Mega Evers. You murdered Fred Hampton. You incarcerated the black. Panthers. So, y'all American history with Donald Trump is really fucked up. To keep my promise, I had to keep my mind. And to keep my mind, I had to keep it occupied. So I gave you American history and I gave you Bible lessons. I gave you the story of Job. I gave you the story of Samson and Delilah. I gave you Moses. Because we've been here for 400 years and ain't nothing changed. Today, Labor Day, and the only thing we did it was traded plantation owners we traded the penitentiary for the plantation cotton for cocaine and we the cash crop like i said i've been in these fields since 1972 where were you black lives don't matter black money do black votes do y'all making a lot of money off of black lives matter so where's that money going since you say black lives matter is it going back into our communities because i don't see it i'm gonna call a spade a spade and call it Call it what it is. This ain't about race and racism because I'm white. My birth certificate says I'm white. My prison ID says I'm white. I'm a prisoner's right advocate, N62528. I came in straight out of the Illinois Department of Corrections in 1991. So this ain't nothing new to me. I'm a jailhouse lawyer. I passed the bar because I'm out. I'm living life. I'm a whistleblower. And we want everything in the light of day. You feel me? Who I work for, the Internal Revenue Service, the Department of Justice, Scott Schellenberger, President Trump. A federal investigation before the 2020 elections. That's me, N62528. I'm a veteran. And this is evidence. I got a jury. That's Judge Cox, grand jury request. See the date? That's Adrian Jones. That's President Trump. And that's President Obama. And this is the case right here. Do blacks have rights in which white America respects? Because I was kidnapped from my family. And we're going to talk about it. That's Kathleen Hughes. Like I said, I work for 85% of the richest people in the state. That was my ceasefire program back in 2008. That's President Trump. That's President Trump. I was kidnapped. Charged with terrorism. You feel me? I was kidnapped and charged with terrorism. Oh, I'm going to just terrorize you with the truth in the toilet. Because when we go to jail, we got to share that toilet. That toilet don't care if you're black, white, straight, or gay. That toilet take your shit every day. And between now and the elections, you got a lot of shit you're going to take from me. And that's Donald Trump. Y'all voted for this shit. And this is the shit that you get. That's Senator Bill Ferguson, Clippinger, right here. Block party gets bigger and better. I'm a video vigilante. That's it. The Maryland Black Caucus. Discrimination in public accommodations. If Martin was here, what would Martin say? Martin would put a collar on his ass. So I'm going to do what Martin ain't going to do. 
Black Lives Matter. Yeah, we're going to talk about it. Broken, but not tattered, but not broken. You ready to clean this toilet up? I'm getting ready to paint it all gold. Since everything that comes out of his mouth is so glorified. We're going to see what he say about that. That's me. We talk about President Trump care about inmates. Well, here it is. Dwayne Davis, L3945, Waukegan, Illinois. All right. 2008, P.O. Box, Miss Althea Walsh. We're going after your prison industry. And the monies you make off of black bodies. Right there, 2019. All right. Johnny Oleski, Baltimore City, Baltimore County. All right. State's Attorney Mosby. It ain't going to be just us 2020. Black votes matter. So do black voices. And I'm a black man that's going to be heard. So you can do what you want to do. There was a parody. It's called The Old Bull and the Young Bull. And I tell this to all my young people. Y'all get mad at racism. Dog, I've been experiencing racism since 1959. I've been eating it, breathing it, and living it since 1959. This ain't nothing new to me. It's new to you. So let's take it like this. The Old Bull and the Young Bull are at the top of the hill. The Young Bull say, man, look down in the pasture. Look at all them heifers. Let's run down the hill and bang one of them heifers. The old bull said, let's walk down the hill and bang them all. I'm going to bang everybody that was involved in my illegal incarceration and my kidnapping. FCC violations by Jane Miller, Barry Sims, Dale Collins, Mary Mubala, Vic Carter, Kai Jackson, Baltimore Brew Fern Shen, Diana Suggs, Baltimore Sun. Those are FCC violations, and the shielding law don't apply to you. Like I said, I'm a jailhouse lawyer. You normally lie to the public to get a conviction, and that shit didn't work because I didn't get convicted. I fired my lawyer and defended myself. Yeah. Don't need a lawyer when you know the law. Now, Ivan Bates said that I couldn't file a class action lawsuit because he make a lot of money off of locking up black bodies. Ray... Kelly already told you we can file a class action lawsuit in Baltimore County because Baltimore County ain't under the dissent decree. So that means that everything that Scott Schellenberger had, had since 2000 and everything that Scott Schellenberger touched since 2007 is subject to judicial review. That means anybody that was black in Baltimore County that was locked up or incarcerated by Scott Schellenberger or the state, they can have that, curse, that case reversed and remanded until Scott Schellenberger is has a disciplinary hearing. Now, Speaker Jones, Sitnor, Corey McCray, the Maryland Black Caucus, y'all been shielding this white corruption because I done informed each and every one of y'all. We're not going to play them games because, like I said, I want 52. Either you're a defendant or you're a witness. Do your job or lose your job. I told Commissioner Harris when he came here to get rid of them corrupt officials. Commissioner Harris, Commissioner Batts, Commissioner Davis, Commissioner Tuggle, yeah, D'Souza, y'all know me, Chief Hyatt, all of y'all going to be defendants because y'all going to testify against the, Dem the Dem Democratic Party. Y'all can't shield them but so long. Killing me is no longer an option because killing me means my kids going to get rich. And I got a lot of kids. Yeah, I got a lot of kids. Each one of them going to sue you. Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter. All my Facebook and MySpace and YouTube and Twitter accounts is going to be evidence for the investigation. Everything that Rob Fix has is evidence for the investigation. This is before the 2020 elections because you've been sitting on this shit since 2006. Ain't no law against making a movie. It is a law against kidnapping. I'm a free man. I'm not a slave. And like I said, this is dedicated to Val King. I gave him my word and I made a promise. I never used the gun. I put my guns down in 1986. I ain't picked up one since. I don't need a gun to beat you. All I need is the power of the pen and access to the courts. See what you do with me in 2020 before the elections.